Okay, yo, what's going on people, right? My name's Cloud9 Reacher. This is my first ever vlog, so be wary of me, bear with me and that. I kind of want to talk about New Year's and New Year's resolutions, resolutions and stuff. Basically, kind of every New Year, you've got that people who go around saying, oh yeah, the New Year is going to be my year got this I want to do for the new year I'm gonna cut off these people like if you've got anything to say just to say to me get off your chest right now last year was a warm-up this year is gonna be my year and then all that stuff is is really cool and it's really positive but when I feel when you keep saying that you ain't gonna do jack poop and this is the reason why when you keep saying I'm gonna start doing things in the new year or I'm gonna cut off people in the new year I feel you're setting you're not putting yourself in control anymore you're only setting yourself up to do something if the new year comes and said it's a new year. Why wait until the new year to start something? Well, you can just start right now. Time isn't going to wait for you. Time will keep going on until you start doing something yourself. For, for example, yeah, like me, myself, yeah, for like many years, I was in like debt, food problems, money problems, issues. It wasn't being paid. House could be taken away. I was really moody and, and upset all the time and I started drinking excessive amounts of alcohol some people don't even know this but I'd, I'd go out and for uh, many hours and just drink and come back to home drunk my mum didn't know because I was just kept to myself and I, I tried to keep a smile on my face but everything was hidden inside and I, I felt to at a point of nearly giving up literally to came to a point of rethinking suicide and, and th different things like that but like I was in I was in a really bad state do you understand and I was, I was skinny okay this is what I looked like when I was when I was in that bad state I was, I was skinny as pup here and I was in the part that you know what I was there I was thinking to myself you know what yeah like I don't want to do this no more like nothing's going for me the acting ain't come in the music ain't come in there's no money coming through Mum's here, she's on my case, people are on my case, I'm not doing anything, you know what, let me just give up. I was like, no, you know all these bad stuff is happening? I can sit here and complain about it and be negative about it, which isn't going to make it really better, it's going to make it worse. Or I could use what I have now and do something about it and try and do something. At that time I had dreads and my hair was really messy. They said, no, bun it, let me try something. Cut off my hair, let a little change then. I ain't wait for no damn new year. I didn't wait for anyone to tell me that any money come with me. I'd use what I had then. If I couldn't make, if I didn't have enough money to go to gym or have enough money to eat food properly, I'd do stuff, certain stuff in my room, push ups, sit ups. Um, I'd, I'd eat what I could eat, which was trying to eat as nutritious as possible, even though those people around still telling me that things are bad. My mum, bless her soul, even though she'll stay still saying that things are bad and all that stuff, I just kept in my mind that, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do something. I'm going to do something with what I've got here. Understand? I just got to keep my mind focused and do what I need to do. And now, this is what I look like a couple weeks ago now. Yeah? And now I've got a new job, permanent job. Yeah, I've got praise God. You, you keep, keep faith, do you understand? I know this isn't like it's an example for New Year's, but it's still an example. I didn't wait for time or a, a big break to come for me. Like what I'm saying for you guys, you don't have to wait for the new year to come for you to start something else new. What? But just because the new year's gonna come, you gotta cut off people who are being disrespectful to you. And bun that, cut them off now. Cause they ain't gonna do, they ain't gonna wait for you. Matter of fact, if every single year, it's the same people. If every single year you're saying to yourself, yeah, new year's resolution, resolutions, last year was a warm up, this year's my best, or this year something's gonna happen, or whatever. If you're saying that every year, then there's a problem. Why don't you instead keep it to yourself what you're gonna do and, and make in the plan in yourself and just be quiet and just do it. Who to say that you say that uh, yeah, I say alright, you know what? I'm gonna wait for until Easter, because Easter is 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 when the, the Lord resurrected and and stuff. I'm gonna wait until then because it's a holy day and it's a really good celebration until I start following Christ. If you realise something needs to change and then you're now waiting for something else to change for you to make that change happen, then there's a problem. You shouldn't, that's what you should, you should, be, should be doing. I think that, that, that goes for everything in life. Even with, 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 even with, for example, actors. A lot of actors out there be like, yeah, you know what, I'm going to wait until I get agent, until I even drama school, boom, I'm going to wait for my big break to come there. Bun that! Yeah? 
done all that ish, yeah? If you're an actor, musician or whatever, why don't you do your own stuff? It's that's why you see me? I'm doing all my own stuff, you get me? Because not I ain't coming, yeah? I'm not waiting for no one to come tell me, hey, this is your big break and anything. I'm not waiting for that. Doing what I need to do. Don't wait. Because time ain't gonna wait for you. Time ain't gonna wait for you. Don't care about you. Yeah, do you understand? Devil don't care about you. If you really want something, go and chase and grab it now. Because everyone else who are going and chasing and grabbing it now, they gonna get it waiting for you. So when they grab it and you sit, still sitting there waiting for New Year's to come to you can grab stuff, it's business. Because if it's gone, if it's gone by then, psh, boy, psh, start now. Because you won't regret it. It's what's up in there. You can allow your mind to tell you that you can't do anything because you don't have certain things, certain tools there to do it until a certain time comes. Or you can just use what you have now and make the most of what you've got. That's why, that's why when people ask me, oh, what's your New Year's resolution? I say to them, I ain't got no New Year's, New Year's resolution. I've been doing my New Year's resolution when I decided that I want to do something with my life. What are you doing? I realised I got pot belly and skinny arms, yeah? And I'm, and I'm, and I'm out of shape and I, I can't lift no 220 kg weight, deadlift no more. I can just barely lift, freaking lift 60 kg off the floor. That's when I started doing something. I ain't waiting for no New Year's to come. That's four months away. I have no New Year's resolution. Yeah, I've been doing it from time. That's too short. I mean, I know life is the longest time you have on, 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 on earth, but it's too short, man. It can be too short. Why wait? Start now. Bun the new year. Bun it. Do it now. Yeah, there. And that's my point made. Finish. Walk up like a boss.